Hey guys, welcome back to another Chaos Battle League video. OP here from the World End Guild, and today I've got to play 50 spell cards. Um, my, that's a little high, so we'll keep it about there. Uh, so this is the deck that I'm using, Bolt, Cannonball, Shurikens, Polymorph, Moby Dick, Sands of Time, and if you don't know, Vultures is a spell card, as you can see there, Rarity Epic type spell. Vultures is a spell card, so I'm going to be using Gatling Gun for defense, and then I'm going to be just throwing in Vultures, Psycho Moby Dick, and then Bolt to uh, slow. All these are a stun. I'm going to have these for utility. I probably should use um, Sandstorm instead of... Um, shurikens, but I'm already at a 4.1, so yeah, we'll just get right into it. We gotta use 50 spells. <laughs> so we got Sam 0420000 France Esport. We're gonna say good luck. <laughs> Just gonna start off with shurikens because that's what I don't want to play. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do vultures, and then we're going to Moby Dick on top. And that's gonna stun that out. I'm gonna go ahead and polymorph this Frankenstein. Whoop! I could have hit that better. Um, now I have to deal with this uh, Pharaoh. That's a lot of damage. Uh, let's get this Gatling up for defense. Then he throws a cannonball. Cool. So we're a little bit ahead. No, actually we're behind because he's level 8. So we're actually behind right now. Um, we're going to go ahead and throw a cannonball right here. Hopefully I don't completely miss. And I don't, so that's awesome. He has a Minotaur coming in. Um, so we're going to go ahead and bolt right here. Um, and then we're going to Moby Dick on top. Because I don't want that damage. Okay, we're going to Shurikens his mummies. Um, and then we're going to... Polymorph right here. And because I don't want his cannonball to get value, whoops, I put that one tile too far to the right. Um, we'll go ahead and uh, sand the time this. And then we're going to uh, vultures on top. And we'll go ahead and shurikens as well. And that will let us live here. And we can actually uh, bronze armor this. And uh, can bolt right here. It's going to let those get in get some damage in. Okay, so we can Moby Dick this here. And it's going to take the tower. Uh, we got those turrets going to defend. We're going to go ahead and uh, set a Gatling gun right here. Maybe we'll just cannonball this way. And that pushes the Frank away by a little bit, giving my turret just enough time to survive. <laughs> Okay, so in addition, we're going to go ahead and Vultures, and Sands of Time this, and uh, at the same time, we're going to Shuriken right here, um, and let's go ahead and just Bolt this. Here's that Frank coming in. Um, we're going to do a Vultures down here, and I guess we can Sands of Time all of this just to slow everything down. Uh, we really just need... To get this off of our tower. Uh, good game. So, uh, we're using all spells. We did really well. Um, so, that's what we could do. Continue. 
see how many spells we got to play that game out of 50. Haha, <laughs> exactly half. Perfect. Let's go again. I think we did really well. Um, you know, we did what we could. Playing Shadow Return. And we're going to say good luck. And we're going to start off with a defensive Gatling gun. That's just going to add defense here. Um, pretty much any troop that he plays, I'm going to want to try to get value on. So I'm going to go ahead and play uh, this cannonball here. And he's going to uh, cannonball my uh, ta uh, Gatling gun along with my cannon turret. Um, so now we can go with vultures here in the back. And we can actually bolt this. Not exactly worried right now. Um, we can Gatling gun on the side. And that's still going to get a little bit of damage out. Uh, we need to polymorph this right away. Whoop. Come on. Thank you. Wow. You guys saw that? Okay. We're going to go ahead and uh, cannonball this right here. It's going to take care of that. Um, let's go ahead and just bolt this right here. You aren't going to want that. Uh, we're going to Moby Dick this. Hopefully that will slow that down. Looks as though we're going to lose that tower. So we're going to be playing from behind. But it's not easy to play a deck with all spells. So we're going to go Vultures here. Then we're going to go Sands of Time that. Then we can actually probably Cannonball this. Probably didn't need to Cannonball, but, you know, it's always nice too. We need to set up some defense, so we're going to actually Gatling Gun right here. He has that Pelican coming in. We're going to polymorph these two down here. Interesting. Okay, so we're going to go Vultures over on this side. Um, and then Moby Dick as well. <clears throat> okay, so that's going to take t that tower. Now I only have spells and a bronze armor. I predict uh, Spartans. So we're going to go Shurikens right here. Uh, we can go Cannonball right here, just to take that guy out. Um, now that that's there, I can uh, set a Gatling Gun right here. And I'll go Polymorph here, because I knew that was coming. Couldn't stop it either way. Let's just go ahead and bolt up these. We'll go ahead and Vultures here, along with Sands of Time. And even when that wears off, we'll go uh, Bronze Armor, and then we will Moby Dick right here. Wow. Okay, so good game. Almost got it. Almost got it both times. So it is difficult to run an all spell deck, but let's see. We get 21. Alright, cool. The good thing about this is that uh, with only four spells need needing to be played, we can switch our decks up. Um, so Polymorph, Bolt, Cannonball, Polymorph. Alright, let's try this one. This is a 4.0 instead of a 4.1. We have uh, three spells here. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, get into this one. Bolt, Cannonball. All right, so we're getting to another battle here. Yay, we got Scoob, so we're probably gonna lose this. We're just gonna say good luck.
And we'll set a clock tower on the same side. Um, we are going to cannonball this. This is cannonball value. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and drop it right now. So it's going to be able to take out his bohia, which is going to be nice. We'll go ahead and drop the sphinx in the back. I'm going to go with the pelican up here, um, as well as Bohia now, and then uh, Clock Tower there, along with Bolt this. Ugh. Oops, too far up, so those are going to die to like one hit or something. Either way. Okay. And we can cannonball this. Dude, his Moby Dick does 600 damage, so he needs one more Moby Dick. So we'll go ahead and set a Sphinx up. And as soon as that Bohia locks on, we're going to want to shoot this Bohia. Okay, so good game to Scoob and uh, as you can see right here he uh, his cards are let's see max 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 level 7 epic the max is level 8 level 7 Moby Dig max is level 8 max uh, scarabs level 7 Gatling gun max is level 8 max gunslinger max gargoyle pack so, uh, Scoob's running around with max cards. Uh, my epics, as you can see, are level 4 pelican, level 5, level 5. My commons are level 9, where his commons are level 12. Uh, his rare is level 10, when my rare is only level 7. Um, so, uh, kind of an unfair battle, but it's whatever. I got the toaster, that's what I was here to do. Um, 551 coins. 5 crystals. 17 Pyramid, 26 Captain, 2 Obelisk, 4 Oni, and an Alchemist. Alright, for these free toasters, we got 107 coins, 1 Scarab, 5 Mummies, 5 Buccaneers, and another obelisk. Awesome. Okay, let's open up the next one. Alright, from this silver toaster, we got 100 coins. We got three pistoliers. Now we have three. Awesome. We got 10 clock towers. One sands of time. And we'll open up this last free toaster. We got 126 coins. Lol, the bronze toaster has more than the silver toaster. Alright, four gargoyles. Seven pyramid. 
and one energy generator. Okay, let's open up this big toaster. We got 1,445 coins, 59 Martians, that's almost up to level 10. Uh, 226 scarabs, very nice. 14 Van Helsing, and 21 Trojan Horse. We do have one more toaster to open, that's the Guild Quest toaster. Uh, we'll, we'll donate this. Yada yada yada. Okay, open this up. We got 589 coins, 5 crystals, 20 clock towers, 23 gargoyle pack. We can finally get to that just to level 9. Uh, 6 energy generators, and 1 trapper. Alright, so let's go ahead and upgrade our uh, gargoyle pack. Upgrade. Finally level 9. It was level 8, now it's level 9, when I was just playing someone who had level 12 gargoyle packs. So, because balance. Alright, we're going to start this toaster, and thank you guys so much for watching. As always, peace.